In a candid and emotional interview on the New Heights podcast, Dona Kelsey, the mother of NFL stars Travis Kelsey and Jason Kelsey, did not hold back in expressing her deep concerns over her son's drinking habits. Dona, known for her no-nonsense approach, made it clear that she is deeply unhappy with the way both Travis and Jason have seemingly followed in the footsteps of their father, Ed Kelsey, when it comes to alcohol consumption. It pains me to see my boys drinking the way they do, Dona said during the podcast episode. I look at Travis, and sometimes I see so much of his father in him, and it just breaks my heart. Ed struggled with alcoholism for years, and I had hoped Travis would have learned from that, but it seems he's fallen into the same pattern. Dona recounted her first meeting with a young Travis, where she immediately drew parallels between his behavior and that of his father's. When I first met Travis, I couldn't help but notice the way he carried himself, the way he would sometimes stumble and slur his words. But before we continue this video, please kindly subscribe to our channel and click on the notification bell for more videos thank you. It was like a flashback to the early days of my marriage with Ed. I knew then that I had to say something, to try and steer him away from that path. Tragically, Ed Kelsey's struggles with alcohol ultimately led to the demise of his marriage with Dona. Ed was a good man, a loving father, but the drinking just consumed him. It tore our family apart, and I vowed that I would never let that happen to my sons. But now, seeing Travis and Jason following in those footsteps, it's like reliving that nightmare all over again. Dona revealed that while Ed Kelsey eventually managed to overcome his addiction and quit drinking, Travis has yet to make that same commitment. Ed came to his senses eventually, he realized the damage he was doing and he turned his life around. But Travis, he just doesn't seem to get it. He's surrounded by the party lifestyle of the NFL, and he's falling deeper and deeper into that same cycle of self-destruction. The podcast host listened intently as Dona poured her heart out, her voice breaking with emotion at times. I've tried talking to him, pleading with him, but he just brushes it off. He thinks he's invincible, that he can handle it. But I've seen this story play out before, and I know how it ends. I can't bear the thought of losing my boys the way I lost Ed. Dona's comments about Jason Kelsey were equally pointed. Jason, he's a little better about it, he knows how to hold his liquor they're a both bit more than men his now, brother, but they're still my babies, but that doesn't make it any less concerning from to me. the same demons that nearly destroyed our family. The podcast host, visibly moved by Dona's candor, asked if she had ever considered staging an intervention or seeking professional help for her sons. I've thought about it, believe me. But they're both so stubborn, so proud. I know they'd just see it as me meddling, as me not trusting them to handle their own affairs. And the last thing I want to do is push them further away. All I can do is keep pleading with them, keep trying to make them understand the gravity of what they're doing. Dona Kelsey's heartbreaking words resonated with listeners, many of whom took to social media to express their support and sympathy for the struggling matriarch. Dona is a hero, wrote one commenter. She's fighting for her son's lives, and she's doing it with nothing but pure, unconditional love. I hope and pray that Travis and Jason wake up and listen to her before it's too late. Another listener commented, This is such a raw and emotional story. You can feel the pain in Dona's voice as she recounts the parallels between her sons and her ex-husband. It's a cautionary tale that too many families have had to endure. I hope the Kelsey brothers take this to heart and make the necessary changes before it's too late. As the podcast episode concluded, Dona Kelsey's final words lingered in the air, a desperate plea for her sons to heed her warnings. I love my boys more than anything in this world. I would do anything to protect them, to save them from the same fate that befell their father. But I can't do it alone, they have to want to change, to break the cycle. And I pray, I pray every day, that they find the strength to do it, before it's too late. The Kelsey family's struggle with alcoholism serves as a stark reminder of the devastating impact that addiction can have on even the most successful and seemingly invincible individuals. Dona's unwavering love and concern for her sons, coupled with her heartbreaking experience with her own husband, make her story a poignant and powerful call to action for anyone who may be facing similar demons. 
As the sports world and the public at large continue to grapple with the complex issues of substance abuse and mental health, the Kelsey family's story stands as a testament to the importance of open dialogue, compassion, and a willingness to seek help. For Travis and Jason Kelsey, the path forward may be a difficult one, but with the unwavering support of their mother, and the courage to confront their own challenges, there is still hope for them to break the cycle and find the fulfillment and happiness they so deserve. And please do not forget to subscribe. See you next time.